Of course, today's message is evidence of things to be grateful for because here in the United States, we celebrate Thanksgiving, which is a whole day of gratitude. This is Jeannie King with Two Minutes That Can Change Your Life. We are told in 1 Thessalonians 5.18, In everything give thanks, for this is the will of God in Christ Jesus concerning you. And having a national day to express gratitude is a lovely way to live. Most of us have heard of the practice of keeping a gratitude journal, and this is a very powerful way to focus our minds and hearts in a good direction. It's easy to look for things to be unhappy about, but deliberately focusing on things to be thankful for really creates a new and brighter outcome. A friend once told me that she keeps an evidence journal. I said, what is that? And she explained that she was so confident in her prayers being answered that she kept a journal and wrote down evidence that each of her prayers were being answered. Hebrews 11.1 1 says, Now faith is the substance of things hoped for, the evidence of things not seen. Do we give thanks in advance, believing that our prayers are heard and answered? And can we find proof of that in our own lives? This week, we can begin to look for evidence of all things that are working out perfectly. And why not? We can always find proof of things going well or, conversely, things going downhill. So let's give thanks, believing that everything is in divine and perfect order. I am grateful for you being part of TUG, True You Group, our online worldwide spiritual church without the church building, and for sharing these messages of love, hope, and inspiration. Thank you so much.